Okay, this is that uh, D311 genset I got last December, and I've been slowly uh, doing stuff to, to see if it'll run. And anyway, one uh, major thing is uh, I got the pony motor to fire today. It wasn't locked up, but it had a locked up exhaust valve or a stuck exhaust valve, and I was able to unstick it through the spark plug hole. The other side's okay. I see if we can fire it off a little bit. And what that means, if it fires off, is I don't have to drain the, drain the coolant or pull the heads and mess with the valves with the heads off. Plus the mag seems to be okay if it fires, so I don't have to tear into the mag. So let's see. Well, that's a little bit anyway. <laughs> I had the fuel tank off. I'm just using a little starting fluid right now. I had a fuel tank on it earlier and took it off and then I decided to go ahead and video it. I picked it up in December. It wasn't locked up, the seller said, but it hadn't hadn't run in many years. So it's all stuff you got to do before you start turning the diesel over and, and trying to start the diesel. Let's see if we can get a little more spark out of it. There we go. Okay, so the pony motor looks uh, looks and sounds okay. I put some fresh oil in the diesel and put the uh, injector capsules back in, and uh, hopefully in a couple weeks we'll uh, fire up the diesel and uh, check it for current. Thanks for watching my video.